get started, I'm going to give you something for free. 2 plus 0 plus 1 plus 4 equals 7. That's God's perfect number. I don't know about you. You just go. Let me look. Let me look. You got your Bibles? Most of you, if you got your smartphone, 
Make sure you go into 2014 and get you a Bible app on your phone. Amen? Amen. They're usually free. Yep. Amen. Good, good word of advice. Amen. They're usually free. Amen. Amen. Psalm 30. And, and, and I want to just read five passages of Scripture and then I'm just going to share some things that God shared to me, to you tonight. Amen. Not going to try to uh, uh, win a, a, a who wants to be the best preacher. I'm not going to try to do that. I, I know I can preach. I'm just going to talk to you tonight. Amen. If you want to see something else, come on a Sunday. That's amen. Amen. Give you something on a Sunday. Amen. Tonight I'm just going to share with you some things to encourage you, to challenge your thinking. And then hopefully when you leave out of here, and it's 2014, you'll have a new mindset. Is that okay? Amen. Here's what it reads. It says, I will extol thee, O Lord, for thou hast lifted me up and hast not made my foes to rejoice over me. O Lord my God, I cry unto thee, and thou hast healed me. O Lord, thou hast brought up my soul from the grave. Thou hast kept me alive, that I should not go down to the pit. Sing unto the Lord, O ye saints of his, and give thanks at the remembrance of his holiness. For his anger endureth but for a moment, and in his favor is life. Weeping may endure for a night, but joy in the morning time. Give me your neighbor a high five and say, neighbor, I think I'm growing on morning time right now. I think I'm close to morning time right now. I don't know about you, but we can make it good for a night, but joy. Somebody say joy. Give me your neighbor say joy. Now here, 
where you know you're blessed. Many of you may not feel that you're blessed, but if you got the ability to nudge somebody, God kept you here for a reason. And because God kept you here, you've got a right to praise Him. Your body been sick, but for some reason, somehow, that, that, 
you're still here today. Somebody, somebody ought to go. I'm only talking to five people. And that five people that will throw their hands up and say, Pastor, do you heal my body? And because he healed my body, I'm going to give him some praise. Oh! 
because of where he brought you from. But also, you need to praise him for where you are right now. And because you ain't where you used to be, you got an opportunity yeah. to change. You got an opportunity to do something with your life. You don't have to do what you always did. God will change you. God will clean you up. God will pick you up. He'll clean you up. You
if 2013 was a year of difficult challenge, financial situation, you might have lost a loved one, but I just come to let you know that God wanted me to drop this on you for free. Weeping may endure for a night, but mental labor, say, let it go. 